This is Spooky Tunnel, one of the most interesting locations I've discovered in my childhood. All it really is is just this big drainage ditch underneath the shopping plaza. Its specific location is underneath the Walmart at Oracle and McGee. You know, just in case anybody here wanted to see it that badly. Now, this may not sound the least bit interesting, but just imagine for a second that you're in fourth grade again. A hole that goes for a quarter mile underneath the grounds would seem pretty cool. Alright, so here's the spooky tunnel, and uh, you know, it was obviously a lot shorter when I found it when I was in like fourth grade, but you know, still, uh, still pretty big. So this tunnel's interesting for numerous reasons. Homeless people sightings, javelinas. Oh, and it echoes pretty well too. Hello! Hey, see, so you hear that? It echoes. Yeah, just in case you didn't believe me the first time. Anyway, there's a secondary tunnel to the north of it. It's not quite as interesting because you can't climb inside of it, but it's still worth noting. Echo! Yeah, so this one echoes too. Yeah, whatever. So anyway, back to the main spooky tunnel. I think I've sized it up enough, so we'll take a look inside the thing. Okay, so just a little side note here. Believe it or not, I'm not actually running this fast. This is just a uh, clip sped up. You know, didn't want to waste too much time just showing a practically blank screen with the tunnel. So I'll just arrive at the destination and we're good. Yeah. Pretty creepy, huh? So this little spot of light right here is pretty much the halfway point in the tunnel. Um, there used to be this chair that was sitting right there. It had these like uh, swastikas and pentagrams drawn in it. You know, I guess edgy teenagers staring out here. But anyway, I'm not gonna walk uh, too much further. You can see that it's pretty much pitch black as the tunnel goes on. So I guess this tunnel is just as uncomfortable as I remember it being. Hmm. Alright, so I would like to point out in this part of the tunnel, it's about 20 degrees colder. So, perfect location for summer getaway. Well, I kind of wish I would have said something a little bit more intelligent during the filming of this video, but, oh well, life's full of regrets. So, in middle school, you know, cool kids like me would just come here after school, sit around and drink these uh, terrible energy drinks, because uh, after all, nothing's more cool than a giant hole. So this kind of brings me to another topic. This uh, tunnel and everything around it is pretty gross. There's just trash everywhere. So for some sick reason, people think it's okay to litter. Anyways, I don't really feel like walking through the entire tunnel, but that doesn't mean we can't see where it ends out. Alright, so this concludes our spooky Walmart tunnel adventure. Needless to say, this is probably one of the most interesting stories ever told by a human being. Thanks for listening and you have a great day.